Hi guys, this is Nishita and welcome back to my channel. From the title of the video, you guys would have already guessed that this is going to be a beauty related video. Being an influencer, every time I post a picture, I get a lot of questions on the lip shade that I'm wearing, the color, the brand, etc. But to be honest with you guys, I have a very few lipsticks and I have mastered the trick of converting those few shades into a large number of shades, which I'm going to share with you guys. So without any further delay, let's just jump right into the video so that I can help you guys up your lipstick game. Before you guys bombard me with all different questions, I totally know and also support the fact that all of us have to stay home. But there's no harm in learning and sharing new lipstick tricks, right? In this video, I'm going to show you how to achieve three different looks with a single lipstick. That is, as a lip stain, a matte finish look as well as a glossy look. I'm going to be showing you how I get the stained look. Now stained look is where my lips look natural. They don't look like too bright or too flashy. They look like natural lips. You can attain this look with any color of your choice but I usually prefer reds or pinks like always. Most of the times I prefer the stained lip look because I feel that it looks more natural and that is my aesthetic. Now I'm going to show you how I attain this look. All that you need for this is a lipstick. Now I'm going to be using a plum colored lipstick. Now this is from L'Oreal. I'm going to leave all the details right here. So yeah, so I have the lipstick and what I do is I just dab some of it lightly onto my lip and then I use my finger and spread it all across. And I'm done. As you can see, this looks so natural. It just looks like my own lips. Like as if I have some rosy pink natural lips. But uh, if you know it, then you know it. I just used the lipstick very lightly and, you know, dabbed it all across my lips. That is it for the stained look. Now I'm going to show you the same stained look in a few other different colors so that you can find out the difference. I'm done. I used a red colored lipstick in this. As you can see, it looks like a natural tint. So, yep, this is the second color. I absolutely love the way it looks. It does not look too flashy or too bright. And for people who prefer lighter shades of lipsticks, I think this hack will do wonders for you. Now, matte is nothing but the opposite of glossy. So, it does not look really shiny but it looks like you know more subtle and uh, i don't know how to explain matte but i hope you guys know what i mean so trick number two how to use any lipstick and get the matte finish i'm just gonna remove the red stain that i have and we have a clean slate now I'm using this one from MAC and this has like a bubblegum kind of pink shade. So this is a glossy lipstick. I'm going to show you how I'm going to turn this into matte finish. First up, you have to apply a layer of it. If you guys can see, this has a glossy finish. The next item we would need is a talcum powder. It can be any talcum powder. You can use any kind of loose powder that you have at home. So I'm just going to take a little bit of this. With my fingers, I'm going to dust some of this powder onto my lips. Just like this. As you can see, it has already turned into a matte finished one. But I feel because of the powder, it looks a little lighter. So what I'm going to do is apply another coat of it and add some more powder onto it. So 
as you can see, this has totally turned into a matte finished lip color. This is a really simple way and in this way you can save a lot of money by converting all your glossy lipstick into matte ones and that way you don't have to invest on a same shaded matte color lipstick. Now moving on to the third hack, it's about how to use any lipstick and get a glossy finish. First off, let me quickly remove the lipstick that I have on. The lipstick is all off. Now I'm going to be using a matte lipstick and then I will show you how to get a glossy finish using a matte lipstick of any shade. After you put your red lipstick on, I would suggest you to dust some powder onto it so that it does not bleed out much. So I have dusted some powder onto my lips and you can reapply the lipstick if you want or if you are happy with the shade, you can let it be and then apply some coconut oil onto it. Again, I'm going to be using my fingers. Now my fingers are like my weapons for this entire video. But yeah, I'm just going to take a little bit and lightly dab it on to my lips. There you go, we have a gorgeous red glossy lip shade ready and you can also use a lip gloss instead of coconut oil but I've been using coconut oil from years now and that works for me so I wanted to share that with you guys too. That marks the end of today's video. I hope you guys had fun and also found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and also subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on my Instagram for more such beauty hacks. I will see you in my next one. Until then, bye.